another day and new challenges. So, uh, this past weekend, I knew, well, relatively new, been here for a little bit of time. I mean, new, I guess. Uh, administrative assistant uh, was offered a pretty sweet gig in the St. Louis metro area. Um, they offered him a gig with a 33% higher pay grade and he couldn't turn it down and so um, he's going to be switching over to do that and I'm really happy for him and it's a great opportunity and I understand the moves he's making and it makes sense and all. So it means like I'm back to back to like in the hiring phase trying to find a new administrative assistant but the good news is is as we were developing this person for this role we created like this online training dashboard that has video trainings and audio trainings and written trainings and it specifies each day do this every week or every two weeks do this uh, here are the one-off tasks to do every once in a while and so it's like we have the, the systems now where we can quickly train the next person to step in and fill this role. So that's exciting. And it's sort of like, okay, the, the work we did yesterday still bears fruit and pays off today. And that's exciting. But you know, it's kind of a bummer. It's gonna be like a time period in here where I don't have an administrative assistant. So we'll see how it goes. The one thing that is kind of cool though, is it's like one door closes, another opens. Um, pretty much coincident with the uh, like learning that my admin assistant got this sweet gig in St. Louis. I'll be switching out of the role. We had a like, couple really great candidates to work for our gym show up <laughs> in our in our funnels here, in our, uh, in our pipeline. So um, the, the good news is, is that um, we might be able to fill this position fairly quickly, maybe, and um, let the the business keep rolling but this time easier and better than we did the first time because we were figuring it out the first time so it's kind of exciting short memo from me today